fuck me, how many of these guys are there? Alright, I'm trying to head back over to Ghazi. So that way, I can complete the mission I was trying to do when I got invaded by the hunter. Ooh, I could- or I could free that place. Hey, friendo! Oh shit, I didn't mean to drink that! Back, demon! Back! I'm kidding! Die! Killing things during the night is a good way to extremely enhance my points. So that's something I want to do, even if I have to face off against the infected. Scratch that, there's one going inside the base right fucking now. Oh boy. My night vision thing ran out. Oh no. Ooh, it's fucking dark. I didn't realize that. Okay. Where's the power? Where's the power? Where's the power? If I can turn that on, the space will become slightly safe. Oh! Jesus! Hey, friends! We should be good, right? That makes us safe. Maybe if I close the door as well. There you go. You know, I could be totally silly. I might actually be completely wrong. <laughs> About how this works. I might not get more points in the nighttime. Uh, for getting the bases. But as long as I have the assumption that I do, that's okay. <laughs> Alright, I'm gonna go out the other side because he's just <laughs> he's just yelling at me. That's not what I want. So I'm gonna operate under the assumption. What am I operating on the assumption of? Oh, jeez. I forgot what I was gonna say! It was gonna be something about the zombies! Oh, Or maybe it was gonna be about the airdrops? Fuck, I'm lost. <laughs> I'm so worried about these goddamn zombies. Okay. I'm gonna operate under the assumption that I have no idea where the hell I'm going. Even though it should be relatively simple. I wanna follow the streets, but there are zombies in the streets. Alright. Well... Oh! Now I remember! I'm gonna operate under the assumption that I can only have one booster thingy on at a time. Oh shit. Get the fuck away from me! Oh fuck! Oh shit! Oh fuck, oh fuck, oh fuck, oh fuck, oh fuck! <laughs> Ow! Stop it! Stop! I don't wanna die! Oh man... I have no idea how to fight against those fuckers! <laughs> like, the infected, the light doesn't scare them away. Fuck! Hunt spent skill points, what do I do? Let's see... Uh, conserve weapons, that'd be really great. Power attack would be solid as well. I'm gonna go with conserve weapons, because I'm really tired of my weapons breaking on me.
Holy shit. Alright. So, will I be lucky this time? Nope. Oh boy. Oh boy, oh boy, oh boy, oh boy. Oh boy, oh boy, oh boy, oh boy. I don't know where the fuck I am. <laughs> I'm just hiding out in here. It has light. So does this go anywhere? Not really. But it has things inside of it. Alright. Oh. I got around them. We're gonna be fine, guys. We're gonna be okay! Unless some of them turn around, then it's gonna be awful. Shit, he's up there? Oh, fuck. That's exactly where I need to go. That's not good. <laughs> We're gonna try my luck. <laughs> oh, okay. We're good. He's on top of the fucking bridge. He's on top of the overpass. Not under it. Oh, I was so worried! What the fucking shit? Alright. That was my own fault. In my own hub hubris? I forgot. About many things. We're gonna make it fucking daytime. <laughs> this is getting ridiculous. I lost any amount of points that I should have gotten. Because I'm all worried about fucking zombies and shit eating the hell out of me. It's ridiculous. <laughs> Even though I do it, I think I have to worry about more zombies in the daytime than I do have to worry about them at night. At the nighttime, there aren't really as many of them, and they don't really see me as well. But then you have the super zombies who, like, kill you. But hey, again, that was my own fault. Shouldn't have been trying to do fucking parkour at night. Because I completely forgot that that area was way too big. I, I guess I should have estimated that it was too far away. But I didn't. <laughs> I was like, oh, I can make this jump! I've made it in the past! In reality, I didn't make it at all. I think. Or did I? No. Alright. I went on this is... Okay. <laughs> I fucking pressed space, but because I was holding D, it made me jump. That was scary shit, man. Crane, I am so sorry about all the shit I have to put you through. Okay. Now, there shouldn't be any, like, big zombies here. There might be a normal one, though. Uh, is there anything in here that I want to get rid of? Not really. Alright. Let's see what weapon upgrade... ...or what this does. Improves handling of your weapon. Increases durability. Improves durability by two. Interesting. I'm not really upgrading things at the moment because... ...I don't really have anything that's, like, long-term. Minus my craft weapons, but once I find like more things like guns and shit, I'll think about it All right, the anti-seizure Avengers. Oh shit, it's actually down here
Oh! Gazi! Scare the shit out of me! I didn't know if we were supposed to be, like, sneaking in here or what! Hello, Gazi. Shh! The movie is on. Mama's watching. <laughs> Are you serious? Okay, we're not gonna shatter your little reality just yet. I am hunting for the medicine. Here we go. That's a lot of them, too. Is Mama happy? Yeah, Mama's real happy. Guzzy got her chocolates and a movie. Well, then I'm gonna take some medicine to help my friend. Well, okay. Oh, Mama stopped getting seizures when her head turned into a pumpkin. They're on the table. Yeah, thanks, Gazi. Gazi make everybody happy. Except for yourself. Well, I guess he's happy with how it is. He just doesn't realize things. We're gonna leave it alone. <laughs> he's happy as is. All right. <sighs> so how far away is the tower? 400 away? And how far is that airdrop? It's kind of along the way. All right, so here's what we're gonna do. We're gonna go for the airdrop. And then head to the tower so I can turn in all my my other things. And then the quartermaster will be like, Oh my god, Crane! You're so awesome for staying out for like two days! And you were doing stuff in the nighttime. I heard you got injured though, so I gotta dock a little bit of points for that. The quartermaster doesn't talk like that. But I like to assume he's a buddy. He gives me free things every day. Sometimes. Alright, I don't have any speed boosts. So that's a little bit of shame, but... Maybe I have something here, let's see. Drop kick, free running adept, get better at free running. Run longer, climb more quickly, gain agility faster, and get access to a new set of running abilities. Oh. Use throwing weapons or a UV flashlight while looking behind and sprint. This helps you stop the infected chasing you. Oh, that'd be awesome! What a- That's all the way back there, jeez. Instant escape, using reversal stuns to bite it for five seconds. Uh, reduces fall damage by half. I, I like- I like all these things. Oh! Shit. I didn't realize I could get health regen. Alright. That's something I'll get eventually. I don't mind running faster. And having longer stamina. Hello, friends! And <laughs> I back up. I'm not trying to hurt you. This is kidding. Ooh, I dodged that. How'd you like them apples? Nope. <sighs> Rises men aren't all that effective at fighting back, but I guess that's good for me. I got another drop. I will be praised even more. Okay. Team four. It was two days before they sealed the city, and our job was to go door to door and find out who was still all right. So we'd knock on doors. Sometimes you'd hear a voice that sounded like a person. So you'd go in. Only it turned out it was a viral, all angry and crazy, with just enough voice left to fool you. Sometimes they weren't alone. The suits are pretty tough. They're PVC with reinforced double-layered polyfiber core. We thought we were safe. It turned out the biters could chew right through it. Sometimes I see some of my old squad shambling around. It gets me down to see them like that. You know the funny thing? They're all biters now, but they can't bite. Because they don't have the brains to take off their masks. I'll tell you, this whole thing is pretty damn strange. <laughs> well, I guess that explains the hazmat dudes. You don't take as many precautions. When you're just like, ah, I've got a suit, it'll protect me from everything. It's all a lie. One big awful lie. Now, do I have any... Uh... Do I have any speed boosters? I do not, darn. Alrighty. <laughs> You know, it'd be interesting to fight a hunter during the daytime. I want to check that out. And they'll be like, wait, what the fuck? I can see everything. Because usually you have it on and it's just like 
Mm, only nighttime. So that way you can make nighttime even more of a pain in the ass. You know? But we'll, we'll, we'll keep it daytime. Now, are there any lichens in here? Because I'd very much like a toxic lichen. Oh, did I even save the, ma the option? Yep, there we go. Oh. Get back to the tower while you still can. Oh. This is Jade speaking. You know the drill. Get to the nearest safe house and wait until dawn. Good night. Good luck. I've made a mistake. So apparently it forces it into nighttime. Just so you can fight the hunter. Yeah, that's awkward. <laughs> that's awkward! Here I thought I was gonna be fighting him in the daytime. Cause that'd just be funny. <laughs> nope. I am just a fool. Let's get out of here. Uh, you know what I need? I need a flare. In my equipment list. So that way... If I really wanted to, I could throw flares around and just screw them over. Well, at least when it's nighttime, I get double the points. All right. Hey, buddy! Why don't you come over down to the safe zone? Rawr! Rawr! Come on down! <laughs> Alright, we'll get out of here. I don't want to be a douche. <laughs> I was just wanting to see if he realizes that it's a safe zone and it'll kill him. <laughs> you know? <laughs> you wanna go, buddy? I just showed you I know how to kick your fucking ass! Oh, hey! The item's in the back of this trunk. Oh, but I have to- I have to have to lockpick. That did the trick, now kill it! Oh, thank God it's dead. Alrighty. <laughs> Let's go back to smacking things. I don't care about the trap that much. <laughs> or not the trap, the lockpick. I'm gonna leave it alone. Is a bright as hell light. I'd love to see the hunter just be like, "Oh shit, what?" But then they wouldn't avoid. They wouldn't not avoid it, right? <laughs> They'd see the flare and go, "Nope, that's a dumb idea." Here he comes! I'm just gonna chill out on the other side of these trains so he can't instant pounce me. Ah, oh, he's all the way up there, damn. I was hoping he was following me underneath the train lights. Nope! Did we get it? Hi, how you doing? 
<laughs> they can see you for, like, a couple of seconds as they die. Is that your moment to, like, taunt the shit out of them? Uh-oh. This is a lot of zombies! I don't watch out for that shit. Getting close. <laughs> I'm trying to throw flares up to him. Get that out of here, buddy. He'll keep his distance. He knows what's up. He gets hit by UV light, he suddenly can't do shit. So I think one of the lessons, minus have abilities, is also keep your distance. Keep your distance. It's out there. Somewhere. And come in from an angle I wouldn't expect. Because otherwise, I can see you within a pretty large radius. Which is pretty overpowered, by the way. I think it's bullshit that I'm able to just spam Q and find him instantly when he's around me. I should have to do something. I should have to do something Let's like... Get out of here. Use my ears to hear him pouncing around. Or have the radius be even smaller. <laughs> But, oh well. Again, I guess, you know, once they're upgraded, that's when it really becomes a problem. Before that, not really. Okay, we're gonna heal, just in case. I wonder if the flare can interrupt the, uh, the pounce. I haven't seen it yet, in use, as a hunter. Nope! Let there be light! <laughs> He's like, I'm gonna be safe back here! It's all a big ploy! Where are you going, friend? <laughs> Ow! He pounded me! That was close! Will he be the first hunter who stays all the way to the end? Or will he leave? Just like the others. I should honestly let myself die a couple of times just to like... You know, make him happy. They'll be like, yeah, I got the drop on him! And I'll be like, oh damn, they killed me. Because it is mean. Imagine spending an hour looking for a game and then being unable to kill anyone. I want, I want, I want him to kill me. No! Oh no! 
you are dead. Wow, that's so anticlimactic. You have all this fucking music and shit, and they're just like, done. Nothing. There's nothing there. All right, I made him happy. Nope. <laughs> you really honestly should be able to pounce on people. Even when your energy is, like, not at full. Because it is a really little ridiculous. I shine my light on them for a split second. That's all. All right, friend. Don't leave now. You're still not gonna get the points. But at least you can give this to me. All a nest destroyed by myself. Fantastic. Thank you, Neneal. Ten volatile spawn kills. Ha. <sighs> Ooh, that volatile man. That was a real fucking close volatile. All right. So, oh, the tower's over here. Good. All right. So, in the time that it took me running around, it actually put me a little bit closer to the tower. If I can get there straight up, I'd I'd be happy. 